So AMD has come out with an official response to NVIDIA's controversial GeForce Partner Program, and it's a basically a declaration of all-out war from their end. So for those out of the loop, the GeForce Partner Program came into the limelight under a very peculiar circumstances last month after hard OCP's Kyle Bennett published an investigative report detailing how NVIDIA was allegedly using the GPP effectively as a monopolistic marketing domination tool. The program allegedly demanded from PC and graphics makers the exclusion of AMD from their gaming branded products, essentially cutting NVIDIA's only competitor in this arena from the gaming market. Companies that refuse to be a part of the GPP are allegedly put at a crippling disadvantage that would render them almost entirely unable to compete. They are denied high effort engineering agreements, early tech engagement, launch partner status, game bundling, sales rebate programs, social media and PR support, marketing reports, and even GPU supply and allocation. Now, NVIDIA has publicly denied these particular allegations. There have, however, been several major developments over the following weeks after the story originally broke, and you can read all of those in depth over on the site listed below. Starting with Gigabyte and MSI removing the products from their roster of gaming products. Two gamers calling for a boycott of NVIDIA and its GPP partners, HP and Dell refusing to join the program, Intel even considering legal action against NVIDIA, and finally the FTC and EU Commission's acknowledgement of consumer complaints and calls for an investigation of the GPP. While I'm not going to read the entire response, we will have it linked in the article in the description, but basically AMD did not mince words in its response and is effectively declaring an all-out war on the GPP and what the company believes it represents, which it describes as anti-competitive and anti-gamer. Now, NVIDIA claimed that the GeForce Partner Program is transparent and great for gamers, while evidence pointing to the contrary kept mounting by the week. The company refused to answer some of the most basic questions about the GeForce Partner Program, like who exactly are those partners that have signed up and what do they stand to gain rather than lose by doing so, and what the program actually offers to gamers that doesn't already exist. It's interesting to see, finally, an official rebuttal from AMD. The video they put out is quite intriguing, and the statements uh, that they are speaking around the idea of uh, democratization of gaming for PCs is quite interesting. Now, right now, with pricing being completely out of the whack in North America, now in other parts of the world it is starting to come down, so hopefully soon in North America it will be. So right now, AMD's parts are a little bit priced higher than NVIDIA's comparable parts. So it'll be interesting to see how things develop over the coming weeks. But at this point, we'd love to hear what you guys in the comment section have to say on your thoughts on the GPP and AMD's rebuttal. But for now, this has been Keith with WCCF Tech TV, and we'll catch you all in the next video.